Here we are in Bountiful Farms vegetative room provided by Pip Horticulture. Currently what you see here is six carriages. These carriages are 44 feet long. That is five eight foot trays and one four by four tray. Currently it's based out or spaced out in zones. So zone one will house 95 plants per tray. As we get into zone six, these will be the plants that will be loaded into flower first and for spatial restrictions and to eliminate canopy effect, these plants will be spaced at 45 plants per four by eight. As you can see here, we've also teamed up with other vendors as well, Fluence. These are the Fluence uh, Spider 2Xs, as well as provided by Vertical Air Solutions. On the bottom rack, we have the VAS system. One of the nice things is the integration of the PIP, the Fluence, and the VAS. Another thing that we decided to go with is we spent the extra money and went with the green Haas inserts. We like these as well because it makes the plants more accessible as well as it eases the clean. These Fluence lights have the capability to be dimmed. We currently start our vegetative right around 300 U moles. We increase that to roughly 4, 450. And then as they enter the flowering phase, they go to about seven and then they max out around nine to 950 U moles. As we stand in this room, it is currently empty. This will change very drastically. As of next week, we'll be loading our first plants into the vegetative stage. They will enter right over here in zone number one. At that time, the production and the perpetual cycle will begin. Every seven to 10 days, there will be a minimum of 240 clones or seedlings brought into this room a day, or excuse me, every five days, to where this will house 3,000 plants at one time. This will then feed our single tier flower rooms for our first phase. As I had mentioned previously, for phase two, we are looking at vertical integration for our flower rooms, teaming up with, once again, Pip Horticulture. The, uh, the irrigation is provided by Netafim. These are one gallon per emitters, depicted upon the size and the zone. The plants will either get one or two emitters and be pulse fed anywhere from two to up to four times a day. The medium in which we will be pulse feeding is Char Coir. In addition to PIP, we also teamed up with the vendors Vertical Air Solutions as well as Fluence. One of the unique, nice things about these is they integrate seamlessly together. The VAS system goes on the outsides as the ballast of the Spider 2X fits perfectly in the middle. Thus, your lights are completely even. The distance between our racks is, is 27 inches. So we will not be growing cultivars any taller than 22 to 23 inches at 24 inches, two feet being our absolute max. The reason we're able to do this is because of the limited amount of heat load that the fluence has put off, you are able to have your plants within six inches of the light itself.